Alright, y'all. This video is for Reborn Records, who I now know is very fucking fake. And you want to know how I know that you guys are fake? You guys have been checking out my Facebook, my social media outside of my job. A real record label doesn't do that. A real record label does not use Facebook for their artists. All right, some do on that level of, you know, using it to promote. But they don't ever go after their artists' personal profiles like you guys did mine. And the thing is, you guys, you say or you say I'm in the wrong, but I'm not. I'm really not. Remember, you guys came to me first. You approached me. I did not approach you. And I still have every single screenshot and email that you guys have sent me to prove that as well. You guys are fake as fuck. I would rather rock with my brothers here on Bloodshot Records than to rock with a fake ass fucking label like Reborn Records. Bloodshot Records is true is a true nonprofit record label. We don't want anyone's money. We help artists make money themselves. We help them become independent artists. That's what Bloodshot Records does. We help artists make money for themselves. You guys claim you're a non-profit label that you want to help make money, but really you're not. And you guys want to sit there and sign me, and yet you're not willing to understand my situation and help me out. And that's not right. That's fucked up. If you guys wanted me that badly, you wouldn't be sitting there saying that you guys do want me and then turn around and say, oh, this is why we, you know, can't use you. Nah, nigga. You don't do that shit. If you want an artist bad enough, you sign them no matter the fucking situation. It's idiotic labels like you that piss me off. Because you guys are all about the money. You're not about developing and helping the artists like you should be. And that's fucked up. You don't do that shit, man. Take it back to the roots. Help the artists out. Help develop them. Help get them somewhere. What happened to the days of... Helping an artist out regardless of their situation and not giving a fuck about what they use or don't use or do or don't do. What happened in those days, huh? How do you think music artists started out way back in the early 60s? Nobody gave a fuck about what they used or didn't, or didn't use or did or didn't do. They helped artists out. They helped bands out and not giving a shit. See, it's motherfucking labels like you that keep messing it up. Well, guess what? I'm here to fix it. I'm here to take back the music industry and put it back to where it should have been the entire time and never should have left. Which is to, you know, help an artist out. And not care about their situation or what they use to make their music as long as they make it. See, what I use shouldn't matter. It's what I do that matters. It's what I do with that shit that should fucking matter. So you can sit there and throw all the logical experience and explanations out that you want. But at the end of the day... You're just covering up the fact that I got your asses cornered. You're covering up the fact that I've got you beat out in this shit. Because unlike you, I don't hide the truth. And that's what you're doing with all this. You're hiding, you're hiding the truth. 
You're hiding the fact that you guys are playing me. And guess what? It's done. I'm not going to sit here and be played by a fake-ass wannabe label. And by the way, another reason I know you guys are fake as fuck, I looked you guys up on Google. There's nothing to be found. Everything else comes up except your shit. I look you up on YouTube. Nothing. So how can you sit there and say that you're a record label when you don't even have a fucking website, dude? If you only got a YouTube channel or a website, you're fake as fuck. At least for my music, I have a website which I am currently reworking right now. I am currently reworking my website for my music. Because if you didn't know, that's what I do when I'm not doing music or anything else. I'm not always gaming out. Hell, a lot of the times, I'm sitting down working, you know, working on my site. Trying to get it up, you know, and running so that people can go to me and purchase my music directly from me. Instead of having to go through other companies and waste their time. But it's fucked up labels like you guys that make me sick. You're fake as fuck. You're so fucking fake. You're fake as fuck, man. Straight up. Like, you know, like I said, you guys approached me. I did not approach you. You approached me. So don't you dare sit there and put that on me. All this shit that's going on right now is because of you guys. See, you're not willing to be understanding about an artist's situation. You're not willing to accept the fact that I have to use what I have to use to make shit work. You're not understanding that. And if you really want me bad enough, you wouldn't give a fuck about what I use as long as I get the job done. And that's what ultimately matters. Is it doesn't matter what you use, as long as you get the job fucking done. It don't matter whether you build it from the ground up, like on FL, on FL Studios, or you use fucking loop sample packs to make your shit. That shouldn't matter. Music is music, dude. At the end of the day, it don't matter how it gets done, as long as it gets done. And that's what fucking matters. So you can run your mouth about me all you fucking want. But at the end of the day, I'm still going to be the same artist that I've always been. And I'm still going to do my thing. So with or without you guys, I'm going to do my music. Now, you guys can either shut your fucking mouths and stop bitching and sign me regardless of what I use or don't use. Or you can move the fuck on and find... You know, another sucker. Take your pick, motherfuckers. What's it gonna be? Are you gonna shut your fucking mouths and sign me and help me get, you know, to where I need to be? Like you guys offered to do? Or am I just, you know, gonna say fuck you guys and, you know, move on and look for another label that isn't you? Oh, wait, never mind. I'm already on a label that isn't you. It's called Bloodshot Records, nigger. Bloodshot Records rules all. Plain and fucking simple. So, like I said, take your fucking pick. Are you going to stop wasting my time and find another artist? Or are you going to shut your fucking mouths and fucking sign me and let me do my job my way? Take your pick, man. Because if you're not going to sign me, then stop wasting my motherfucking time. And stop wasting my brother's times.